up. <sighs> Sorry, is that uh, that's got to be annoying, no? It will be. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I'm Mason Michon. I live in Whistler, BC, and this is my Action X50, and it's currently packed for water photography. Let's take a look inside. All right, so in here I've got the medium DSLR core unit with a 1DC full frame body. It's a large camera body with a 70 to 200 lens on it. Then I have a 300 lens here, and in behind it, I have a two times extender tucked in there for long shots, and then I have a medium wide angle, 24 to 105 there. And then this is where I usually keep my 17 to 40, but that's currently on the water housing, which is in the upper portion. When I'm shooting water photography, it's either fishing or surfing. And so that's why I've got my fly fishing set up right here. And then in this pocket, I've got, so I've got my kick fins tucked in the front pocket for when I'm swimming in ocean currents. And then on this side, I just have my small carbon tripod. In the roll top, I currently have my Aquatech housing for underwater photography. So this thing's pretty bulky. And what I like about having this large roll top opening is that I can access this really easy. I mean, this thing, like, I, I don't normally travel with it like this. This is more for, you know, a strike mission of some sort where I, I'm going to want to have that ready to go at any moment. Now, on the front pockets here, I've got a mobile phone. It's an iPhone 10, And then on this side, I've got a pair of sunglasses and a multi-tool. So I like to have those things handy, so I keep them on the front. But yeah, that's kind of, that's the general setup for water. Okay, so this is my backcountry setup here. In this front panel, I've got the shovel and probe, safety equipment, and there's room in there for a couple extra small items like gloves. And then I have my pole strapped to the outside, tripod on this side, and then on the front, same as last. I've got the phone in this one, and then sunglasses and a multi-tool in here. In my main compartment, I've got the same camera block configuration with the medium DSLR, but in addition, I have the small drone package integrated there. Now in the roll top, I've got an extra layer, goggle lens, extra gloves, my skins, and a couple face masks, and a pair of binoculars. And then in the smaller pouches, I've got loose items like slings and heli straps. Okay, so that's my backcountry setup. Now I'll show you what I pack for an overnight. So this would be my typical setup for an overnight or a bike packing trip. On the outside, I've got my water bottle, a knife, bear spray, cell phone, tripod. And then up top here, I've got a hammock and a sleeping bag, all pretty compact in there and then up front here I have a small tarp and an inflatable mattress so I got all my gear in here for an overnight to be comfortable sleeping in the mountains in mild weather and then in here I've got my core unit with a jet boil some dried food and a camping cup I'm Mason Michon and this is how I pack my Shimoda Action X50.